What's going on guys? Zeke Man here. I am in Tokyo, Japan. We are taking a tour of the Sinjuku fish market. And uh, there's a lot of, obviously, fish, sushi, the original street food areas, and I don't know what else we'll see, but let's continue on through the Sinjuku fish market. This is uh, very famous here. This is a Wagyu beef stew. Very popular. Look, there's a line. Everyone's eating it here on the sidewalk. I think that will be in the future of today's videos. <laughs> Onigiri. This is the outer part of the fish market, obviously. White strawberries. The size of those oysters, huge. <laughs> Oh, 
No, there's, there's too much like I don't, I don't want to spell. This is uh, fresh wasabi, wasabi and bamboo shoot. Beautiful pieces of fish. Very, very cool market. It's so much different than anywhere in the world. It's everything is so organized and so clean uh, versus these wet markets and other fruit and vegetable markets that we go to that I've taken you to throughout the world. And um, it's just really funny, you know, in Japan, everything is structured and clean and it's no different in the market either. Dried scallop. For ramen soup stock. Oh, okay. Many Chinese people. Yeah, oh, okay, yeah, makes sense, yeah. And then I So later we will try that. More white and red strawberries. And the color combination of red and white is considered auspicious. Oh, okay. Oh, eel. We ate this yesterday. Oh yeah, oysters, big shrimp. Mr. Famous Sushi Man. Coffee or tea? Yum.
Lot of um, some nuts. Sesame. We put them on white rice. White rice. Oh, wasabi. Wasabi. Mm. Just sarada. Oh, rice. Mm. Mm. You just wasabi. Lucas. Crab. Very good. Whoa. Oh, is, oh, crab. Crab, yes, dried crab. Yes. No, no. I'm okay, yes. <laughs> The shrimp, yeah, you, you can eat um, shrimp, shrimp. Oh, shrimp. Yeah, no, no. Shrimp. 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 Oh, uh, yeah, that's mm. Thank you very much. Wow. It's like umami wasabi. Umami wasabi. So good. Very, 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 very contrasting flavors, but they go so well together. It's funny, everyone waiting patiently. And these markets are so quiet. You know, nobody's yelling at you. <laughs> come buy this, come buy that. You handsome man. <laughs> we finished up walking through the outer market and then we went into a little bit of the inner market. They didn't allow video in there, so. Um, but it was really cool. They had a lot of, um, you know, little sushi, everything that you could buy um, off off the boats. And then we also bought some sushi here to try, all of us. So we got this nice fresh sushi, some little baby squid, and some white strawberries. So. So we have a nice oh, little uh, nice treat, nice little treat here um, this afternoon. Um, it's uh, only about 11 in the morning, maybe, okay. and we've been eating literally all morning <laughs> since we started. Um, so yeah, so we're gonna just eat here and just kind of uh, take a little break, yeah, take a break. catch up, and uh, I'll see you guys soon. It has so, wings. So I'm curious about this. At home, that would be unripe. <laughs> and, no, it's mm. not. It's a white. Yeah, yeah, it's yes, a, a lape, but uh, it's, mm -hmm. it's supposed to be white. <laughs>
crossbreed, yes, crossbreed, and then subtle flavor, and then gone for another year. Oh, I see. So we, that there are 47 prefectures in Japan, each prefectures, the farmers in each prefecture compete to grow the strawberries. We can't compete, on, although we have amazing burritos. Mm -hmm. How about mm. that? It's good? Yeah, so Lucas, Lucas how was the taste? Yeah. Japanese strawberry? Good. Mm -hmm. And then of course you have all the Japanese. And oh, the oh, yeah. yeah, everything's Cuisine. going away. <laughs> uh, yeah.